for my brother! Die! How does it look? Crawling with Saxon soldiers like lice on a swine. The very sight sours my blood. Would the sight of their bodies in the mud please you better? One way to find out. Eivor, I beg you. Alfred's men or not, they are Saxons and Christians. If I could speak to them, we might avoid bloodshed. And lose the element of surprise? These people make their living by the blade. We should attack headlong. You know the people of this isle better than I, Stowe. I trust you. Thank you, Eivor. I will do what I can. Brave soldiers, my name is Stowe, Reeve of London, and this Dane at my side is Reeve Erke. He is my partner in London. Together we see that justice is done. But more, he is my friend. In London we live in harmony with the Danes. So could you. But your king does not share our philosophy. Alfred bleeds his land dry. Works you all to the bone for a needless war. Now he wants you to die for it. So I beg you, in God's name, walk away from this camp. I will find you new and worthy employment in London. You are good men, and true. I would not want this day to be your last. This one's right. The Danes are here to stay, like it or not. What good's dying now? Don't be a lackwit. Soon as you drop your swords, they'll murder us. That's no heathen talking, he's a Saxon. I, for one, believe him. Come on, lads. It's a new life in London for us. Better that than dying here in the mud. We'll deal with you traitors later. The rest of you, attack! Brave try, friend. But now we do things my way. When words fail, tyrants speak down.
about destroying full kiss supplies. gentle if they spot me. All is ready? We're town of farmers and shepherds. This place bristles with swords. One of them is a thane by his dress. Serious men with him, too. Went into the longhouse. If we take care, we might avoid drawing the thane's attention while we burn the grain silos. Ha! <laughs> Was that a jest? Bring them on! Been too long since I met a Saxon warrior worth half a shit.
Christ of Flank! Finish it! What? Dark spirits torment this land. What have you discovered? Bridgeworth swarms with guards, reinforced from the river. Word is that two of Fulke's finest oversee such matters. We should kill these leaders and burn their ships. Crippled and put to panic, their men will be in no place to join Fulke at Porchester. Frightened men look to their own interests. A good plan. Time to shoot! Ah! 
On my way. Sailing for these sexes. Indeed. The other side must be barred. Show me what lies ahead.
They see me, this will get messy. Loma, what is happening here? Bandits, taking advantage of the disorder in Suffolk to fill their pockets. Odin smiles on us today. Let us make sure this place is burned to the ground. Fulke will get no more weapons from here. We could charge in while they are distracted, but it would be safer to use fire arrows. We burn them from afar. Watch them scatter like cats. A sound decision. I agree. Take your positions! Stand ready, Eivor! 
When they see us, they will charge. We must defend the men. We must be careful now. <clears throat> the best defense is to attack. Go! Get in there, Chief! Move in, men! Storm the town! Show me. to our camp. <laughs> 